Here we go. Let's go over three Kramer's rule questions from the past three years in MA265 final exams. So we're told that AD minus BC equals 2 and that C is equal to 2A minus 4. And uh, we're finding the value of Y determined by this linear system. We know that by Kramer's rule, we can set the value of Y equal to the determinant of this matrix, but with the Y column, the second column in this case, uh, that'll be all the values that are multiplied by y, if we multiply this out, replaced by the vector that everything is equal to. So that will give us a, c, 1, 2, and then we're dividing by the determinant of this matrix with nothing done to it. So a, c, b, d. This will give us 2a minus c and a, d minus b, c. We're told that a, d minus b, c, right up there, is equal to 2, and we can take this uh, numerator and say 2a, uh, not 2a is equal to c, but uh, 2a minus c is in a form where we can uh, kind of rearrange it and figure out what's going on over here. So if c is equal to 2a minus 4, then c minus 2a is equal to minus 4, and 2a minus c is equal to 4. So this numerator is just 4 and our answer is 2. 8. Let 3a minus 2b equal 3 and 2b minus c equal 4. Let's find the value of x determined by this linear system. So yet again we're setting x equal to the determinant of the matrix with the x column uh, up here replaced with this c6 vector. So we'll have c6 b3 and we're dividing everything by uh, the determinant of this matrix unchanged. A, 2, B, 3. This is equal to 3B minus 3C minus 6B, all divided by 3A minus 2B. We're told that 3A minus 2B is equal to 3, and we can factor out Actually, let's, let's just work from this forward. So 2b minus c is equal to 4. c minus 2b is equal to negative 4. 3c minus 6b is equal to negative 12. So if we take, we take uh, negative, negative 12 and put it, just making sure that everything, yeah, everything checks out as far as I can tell. If we put negative 12 up here, our answer will be, negative 4. And problem 4, well, it's actually problem 3 for us. Given constants a and b, consider this linear system and find the solution uh, using Kramer's rule. So we can rewrite this in the form that we've seen above. 9, 4, 2, 1 times the vector x, y equals a, b. And now solving, uh, we will see we will see that x is equal to uh, the determinant of the matrix with the x column replaced with a, b. So a, b, 2, 1, all divided by the determinant of 9, 4, 2, 1. That's just 9 minus 8, so uh, 1. And y is the determinant of this matrix right here with the uh, y column replaced with a, b. So 9, 4, 2, 1. Oh great, in addition to the birds and the nice outdoor noises, now there's um, someone doing some leaf blowing. Hope you can't hear that. And this will, sorry, this is, and it distracted me enough that I wrote 9421 instead of 94AB. There we go. So before, before the landscaping gets too loud, uh, we have A minus 2B and 9B minus 4A. And these would be the values uh, of 4X and Y determined by this linear system. And we're done.